Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 Edition. Page 427. Spinal Cord Lower Extent. How far does the spinal cord extend in an adult? In an adult, spinal cord extends to the lower border of L1 to L2 vertebrae. How far does the subarachnoid space extend in an adult? In an adult, the subarachnoid space, which contains the CSF, extends to the lower border of the S2 vertebra. What level of the vertebra is the lumbar puncture performed? The lumbar puncture is usually performed between L3 and L4, or L4 through L5, which is the level of the quadra equina. What is the goal when performing the lumbar puncture? The goal when performing lumbar puncture is to obtain a sample of the cerebrospinal fluid without damaging the spinal cord. What is the mnemonic to help you remember what area to perform the lumbar puncture? The mnemonic to help you remember this is just remember to keep the cord alive, keep the spinal needle between L3 and L5. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.